If I rebase to British territory, it would be a little bit quicker. Then I could move them. But then again, we'll see. Right, don't rebase. Are you telling me I can't even transport? Motherfucker. So, because it's out of range, isn't it? Right, how about if I rebase the British territory? I don't know what that would do, so we're going to have to save whatever we can then. And that's most likely going to be very, very little. Oh, god damn it, I wasn't watching and I lost two battleships. God damn it. Yeah. I mean, could I um, evacuate to Britain? I don't know. That's good, isn't it? I mean, um, could have saved the vast majority of the entire French army, but no. I love the fact that Britain stops giving us um, lend lease as well. It's like, come on, Britain, be a mate. Yeah, we're probably going to lose everything a lot faster. Yes, the um, Maginot line is cut off now. Right, fall back to Paris. I better be able to keep these troops. Come on, guys. No, pause, you stupid... Oh, my God. Right, just save the most populous regiments. I mean, I have 14 units here. That's 14 divisions more than what I would have. So it's not all bad, I suppose. Oh, thanks, Britain. Dick. Right, 
Right, we might be able to pull off one more evacuation run here. Maybe. Right, another eight divisions. We are sending supplies down here, it's just the fact that it's so terrible. France is rapidly falling. Man, if I didn't have to go all the way around Africa, I could have saved so many more men. Right, we might have one last shot here. Right, retreat to Paris. As long as we hold on to it, we should um, be able to last. Right. Save what we can. I'll save the best of the best if I can. Okay. Hmm. Well, actually, what we can do here is, I'll take you, and uh, for instance, you. At least we can take that support. Hmm. Ah, oh, right, I see. Hmm. I suppose we'll leave it like that then. Probably the last run we'll be able to make before France inevitably falls. Paris is under heavy assault. Right, I'm going to turn this off now, it's going to be really annoying. Norway has been conquered. Go, 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 go! We may have time! Kaiser Wilhelm. Right, only Marseille. Oh my god, we actually managed to make it. Holy shit. I'm sorry, man.
Yep, and the pot fell. Paris has fallen. I better get to keep those men. Yes! Fantastic! Right, so how many men did we manage to save here? More than we would have had before, so that's fantastic. The Soviets are mobilizing. Germany will fall and we will be there to take advantage. Right, we are going to uh, have the Navy rebase to uh, Alexandria. Right then. Wait for the last group of men. Lucky sons of bitches, though. We are completely out of oil and supply. But we managed to save 45 divisions. 45. That's good enough for me. In time, we may even have enough manpower to create a HQ. <laughs> oh dear. I can't even move now because I don't have any supply. Right, production. <laughs> I don't even have enough supply. Ah, uh, superb. Okay. I mean, I could give my navy to the British. As they would be able to supply it and everything. But, uh, my navy's my navy. We did manage to put up a hell of a fight, though. Alright, let's get some manpower here. Hell of a fight. We'll create a new command. Right. Free French Supreme Command. Wow, he's uh, undoubtedly our best commander. Like Koenig. Right. Now well, we do have some HQ, so that's uh, good news at least. Come on, Britain, I kind of would like some Lendleys. Don't be a dick. You kind of did leave me to die. Ah, oh, Yugoslavia's gonna fall now. Poor Yugoslavia. Ooh, attacked from uh, both sides. Partisans. Uh, did we manage to save that Air Force too? Yes, we did. Right then, so our new capital is Libra. Libreville. But yes, can't complain. Can't complain. I think I'll move the navy down here then. Yeah. Oh no, 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 no. Oh. Oh wow. We're probably going to lose something here on the way out, but I'd rather try and escape. Free France must survive. Right! <laughs> okay, what do we do now? We are completely out of everything. We've been, um... Well, we had to evacuate. Bam, 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 bam. But at least we survive. France lives on. Mm-hmm. 
Okay. I do wish I had some supply. And Greece will fall now. A dark time in Europe. Ah, the British have taken over Sardinia. And uh, we managed to sink some more ships on the way out. There's a hell of a lot of Bra uh, British naval units. Right, French generals defect into Vichy, France. Oh, wow, that's so many. Koenig has remained. We still have some nice commanders left. I mean, all our commanders were incredibly skilled in the latter days of the war. A British HQ. I think the Soviets will steamroll. I think they will absolutely steamroll. Oh, Dave Infamy. Rightio. This is the day that will live in infamy. The United States of America has been suddenly and deliberately attacked by the Empire of Japan. Toro Toro, I need to watch that film again. It's actually really good. Hello there. You kind of want to give me some uh, Lendleys? Are you in the Allies? No, you're not in the Allies yet. Come on, man. Seriously, I do need supply. <laughs> uh, I'll buy supply. Yes. Right, we have the Arsenal of Democracy. The end of the beginning. Oh, come on! Can I get debt? Request debt? I don't have anything. Okay. The Allies have declared war on Japan. The United Nations. Ah, oh, how are you doing there, Poland? Yeah, exactly as well as I would imagine. But the thing is, it's November, it's December 1941. And Germany has only just taken the rest of uh, Europe. Mexico too, sweet. How are you doing there, Mexico? I mean, the Soviets have mobilized. The Germans have forever lost their chance at actually taking the Soviet Union by storm. So, yeah. Ah, oh, Greece was conquered. Right, we just need to be careful of the... Uh, Japanese. Can I move any of these men? Can I move by strategic? No. Right, how about I move by ship? Aha! Right, there we go. At least I can protect my ports. Indeed. What the hell? Oh, it's an American. Okay. Yup. Ah! Got, um, Corsica, too. Lovely. Hmm. Yugoslavian submarines. Ooh. So, of course, the issue is we don't have any supplies. At all. Uh, what are we going to do about that? Um. Uh, what can I do? <laughs> Because I'm a government in exile, I can't request Lend-Lease. Which would have been fantastic. If I could have requested Lend-Lease, I could have, um... Yeah. And we'd lost Indonesia. Um, Indochina. That's a shame. Hmm. The Japanese are ravaging the... Dutch holdings and the British holdings. They are advancing into India. Well, into, uh, Bengal. Hey, Bengal. No, that's not right. 
Hmm, what the hell is this called again? I can't remember what the name is. Oh. Hmm. I can't remember. It's completely slipped my mind. I can't remember the name of this region. I mean, this is like where Bengal is. Oh, God, I can't remember. Ah, uh, the Axis has got Romania. Alright. Basically working on officers. Um. I need supply production. Ah, there we go. Fall of Singapore. I don't know if the British can hold on to India. Hmm. At least we don't see any threats in... Uh... Yes, for the motherland. Uh, Pravada reports that vile fascists have attacked the motherland. Is it more... Is there a more reliable source to arms, comrades? We must show the invaders. Right to the German Reich and the Soviet Union and now at war. Okay, this is going to be interesting. I really hope the Soviet Union wins here because if they don't, I'm freaking screwed. They should win in the end. I mean, the Soviets are already mobilized. They will wait on the front line. So we'll have to see. Come on, Soviet Union. You can do this. You can do it. As the front gets larger, the Germans are going to end up, um... Buggered. Right, Riga's going to fall. Oh, yep, Riga's fallen. Oh, please God, don't fail me now, Soviet Union. Hmm. Come on, you can do it. Minsk has fallen. Oh god, please don't fail. Okay, I I really need Oh god, they're losing city up to city. Right, Minsk has fallen again. They did retake it, but, uh, yeah. The first the Germans really ever got was Stalingrad. So, come on. Hmm. I don't understand how <laughs> they're having issues here. The Soviets had plenty of time to mobilize. They were mobilized. They've had years. They've had like an extra year or so to build up. Bloody hell. It shows you the um, supreme firepower of the German army. But we managed to hold it off for a goddamn long time. Right, seems like they're starting to make gains back in some areas. Okay. I probably rescued far too many troops now, as I can't produce enough supplies. I need 16 and I can't afford it. Right, the good thing is, the Soviets aren't facing the entire German army, while the Soviets have their entire army. Hmm. Right, there we go, supplies production. Uh, Right, we don't need as much now due to the fact we're producing more. Uh, 
Um, right, it does so. They're right in the outskirts of Leningrad. I tell you, if Leningrad falls, I'm going to be pissed. Are they at war with Finland? Yes. Actually... No, I don't think they're at war with Finland. The Great Patro uh, Patriotic War. That should help them. Right, the fall of Sydney. Oh god. How are they doing so badly? Right, it's starting to push back in areas now. But the Reich is still pushing. God, this is horrifying to watch. Right, IC efficiency, that's always lovely. Right, it seems they're now at war with Finland as well. That's no good. Right, the Polish have uh, risen again. At least that's going to divert some attention away. And uh, yeah, see, they're pulling forces back from the front now. The Danish have risen as well. Again, bringing their attention elsewhere other than the Soviets. Okay. Finland um, might be conquered. Ooh, coordination, sure. I'm happy to have some energy. A little bit more icy. Right, yes. Now see how they're losing ground. Are you fucking kidding me? They lost Leningrad. Oh, you bloody fools. Defense, okay. Hmm. Dissolution of the Third International. The fall of Leningrad. Ah, oh, the Dutch are doing. Uh, the Danish are doing pretty well. Bloody Dutch! I'm going to get hanged for that one now. Viva la resistance! Hmm. This is going to be interesting. It seems as though the Germans have finally reached that line in the sand. And not one step forward. Sorry, not one step back is in effect. And uh, we are seeing British forces over here in Greece. That's a little bit, ma uh, well, mental. I'm not going to lie, you're just going to lose these divisions. But sure, if you want to, like, throw away men like that, you do that. What the hell happened over here? Oh, the AIs. Oh, you bloody idiots! How? Great. The British lost Egypt. Christ. How did they lose Egypt? How? They have the entire bloody Royal Navy and the American Navy to help them now. How could they fail? Oh my god, they've even lost over here. GG, mate. GG. Tell ya. Right. So Finland has been conquered. That's good to see. Ah, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. How many men do we have then in total? Let's uh, do a quick tally. Right, Supreme French Commander. Right, we have, wow, just 47,000 men-ish. 43. But alas, until next time, goodbye for now, guys. Okay, guys, so, um, this is just going to be put on to the end of the episode. I said 43,000 men. It turns out I forgot to do the theater commands. And we shall actually have... There we go. We managed to save 387,000 men at present. Great news. We have this HQ over here. 
uh, which is attached to my navy, actually. So we'll uh, detach them. There we go. This uh, command, I don't know how it got over here, but it's basically there. So, uh, go figure. Go figure. What else are you in command of? Ah, you're in charge of the Air Force. Right. Oh, we do have a air base. I must have missed that. Sweet. Okay. Get rid of that. Um... What else? Ah, fine, whatever. There we go. Uh, so we have 387,000 men. If we could reinforce them, we could have a lot more, which I probably will do in a moment. Well, next time. Uh, so yes, guys, we managed to save, I don't know, maybe four, five hundred thousand men from defeat in France. So, uh, depending on how the war may go, if we ever were able to land back in Paris, well, back in France, we'd have an army to start with, which is important. And who knows how things could go. I may have to use a little bit of cheap to get some supplies, and then we might have an African campaign to retake Africa. That could very well be possible. I mean, I have an extreme amount of force here. 51 land units, um, a decent navy, some air squadrons. I think it'd be possible. I just need some supplies to pull that off. Um, so let me know down in the comments down below, guys, if you think I should cheat and give myself a little bit of supply, a little bit of oil, just to carry on this um, African campaign. So I'd like to thank you all so very much for watching, and, um, indeed, it was it was a fun run trying to hold uh, France. We tried, but we ran out of manpower. So until next time, thank you so very much for watching, I hope you've enjoyed this as I have. And if you're new to the channel, do go ahead and subscribe for more. And until next time, goodbye for now.